Don't mind the mess. Glint's a terrible maid. This is just where I come to get some distance when I need it. Some place to call my own. It's his crow's nest. It absolutely is not. I didn't drink that by myself in case you were curious. In fact, I didn't have any of it. After Glint brought me to life, I quickly came to realize that Guardians recognized me as whoever I was before. They... weren't always kind. <sighs> so I took to wearing a helmet to hide my face. Before a spider. Even then, I rescued a warlock and her ghost once. She offered me a drink afterward, but I left before she came back with it. I don't know why, but I returned for the empty bottle later. I've always wondered how she would have treated me if I'd stayed. If she saw my face. I forgot this was here. My first memories are waking up under this shroud. The first thing that was mine. It was comforting somehow. I couldn't bring myself to throw it away. Someone cared enough to lay me to rest. I meant something to them, whoever they are, and that means something to me. I've learned many things since my second birth. Fear, humility, but this, this was where I learned pride. That sword belonged to the Hive Knight I killed to protect Osiris. It felt good, saving someone so important to the Vanguard. Someone who used to be an outcast. It was like I had finally found my purpose. Like I was brought back for a reason. And there you were, Guardian. Spider wanted all of this thrown out, but I couldn't bring myself to. Even broken, it might still have a purpose to someone. I've heard that before the collapse there used to be an art. It took broken things and put them back together with precious metals. It made something new and beautiful out of something that would have just been thrown away. Oh, right. Glint gave this to me. It was a gift. It was the dawning. Your first dawning. The first time I ever felt like it might be safe to be around other Guardians. I'm not stupid. I know... The person I used to be, he did something terrible. I can feel it when people look into my eyes and see him. The way you looked at me when we met. I don't ever want to know him. <laughs> 